Hello, my name is Martin, and I recently got the Nifty case for my birthday. And as you can see, I also bought the Mr. Filter with it. And uh, I decided that I'm going to venture into having things play music out of their own, which is also called generative music. Uh, I will eventually try to move into generative ambient, as I saw wonderful examples on YouTube. Um, but I'm still very much a beginner, so what you'll see here are some weird experiments that I am doing. Um, so, as you know, the Nifty case, or may know, the Nifty case has two oscillat oscillators in the chips module, um, which produce sound, and you can route that from the chips module directly to the output. And then you have a tone that plays, that can be changed with the uh, control here. Now, if you want this to be random, you will need to hook that up through the LFO. And you can hook up the LFO to the tune input. And here you can see that it is set to random and then it plays random notes. So I would say with the basic nifty case you can already play random music but it's probably not what you're interested in. You can tune the amplitude, I mean sorry, the frequency with the knob to make it a different range. Next step is to make it more like actual notes that are being played and this is why I purchased the Mr. Filter which I will hook up now so the output will go into the input of the amplifier and then from the output of the amplifier back to the sound here so now we have the same sound as before except that we can now control the volume so we can make it softer and louder and the next step is for that to be controlled by the uh, LFO. And since I probably will want more of those, I'll hook it up this way. And then we use the envelope generator here and hook up the output of the amp uh, envelope generator to the uh, amp amplifier. And now it plays notes. So to make the notes sound a little bit more interesting and flexible, the next step would be to uh, use the filter. And for that, we hook the output of the amplifier to, well, do we do it that way? I think we hook the, uh, it first through the filter and then from the filter to the amplifier. So now we can control the sound a little bit, we can add some resonance. But to make the sound more interesting, it would be better to also have that controlled by the LFO. I mean by the envelope, which is then controlled by the uh, LFO. And I'm using the fast instead of the slow for it to be a different effect. So now we have it play random notes and we can change the speed um, 
As I stated in the beginning, the chips actually has two oscillators. This is allows us to use the other oscillator too. So we can control the tone of the first oscillator and move that to the output as well. I think this is as far as I can get with the current system. I would like to quantize, quantize the notes a little bit so they are more in tune. And there's other options that I will be looking at in the future, but you will see those here. Thank you.